evening, councillors. Take a seat. Good evening and welcome to Annual Part 2 of the meeting, Council Meeting. I would also like to extend a warm welcome to the reconvened Council Meeting to those members of the public that I hope you find it informative. Those who are you over there. <laughs> First item of business is declaration of interest. Councillors, you are asked to consider whether you have a dis disclosable pecuniary or any other relevant interest in connection with any matters to be determined at the meeting, and if so, to declare the state of the nature of such interest. May I remind you that you should state the item number and title of nature of interest in question. Any declarations of interest? Moving on, um, civic mayor's announcements. I have been notified of the following apologies. Uh, Councillor Tracy Pilgrim, Councillor Jeff Jeffrey Watt, Councillor Paul Dowerty. Any other further apologies? No, this is good. Is anybody there? <laughs> I would like to congratulate and welcome the three newly elected members and those successfully re-elected. Well done, gentlemen. Um, and that is <laughs> David uh, Burgess Joyce. Welcome, David. Uh, Angela Davis. Welcome, Angela. <laughs> and welcome back, Brian.
and I will ensure that I get um, an early draft uh, as early as possible to the two opposition leaders uh, for their uh, comments. Thank you, Mr. Okay, thank you. Uh, moving on to matters required approval by the council. Council, we now turn to item 12 on page 21 to the 68 of the supplement papers, which includes reports on the appointments and consultation of council committees for 2015 and 16. Appointments to statutory and advisory committees, working parties and panels for 2015 and 16. Appointments to outside bodies and organisations, policy council agenda. First item on page 21 to 39 of the supplements, appointments and constituting of the council committees. I invite the leaders to move the recommendations in respect of the consultation and membership of the committees, named and appointees to committees, may be submitted to the head of legal and member services. Is there a second Yeah, I'll say that as well. We've supplied all names to yeah. so, uh, the is there an amendment to the proposed understanding laws? Just say so that we've also supplied our names, but can I ask the leader in connection with the chairmanship of the policy and performance committees in last year, the Labour group took all the chairs. <coughs> is the leader still intending that his members should still take all the chairs, or is that a matter which might be considered? Uh, yes, we will take all the chairs. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. All those in favour of the amendment, please clearly indicate. I will, we don't, there is no amendment, so. <laughs> All those in favour of recommendations in respect of the appointments for consultation of council committees for 2015-16, please clearly indicate. Those votes uh, for. Any votes against? Thank you very much, Castle. 